Well, that's the comparison. A single to start the over. Dhruv is continuing. Bowling his last over of the spell. It's been economical so far. He's gone for just three and a half runs and over. And let's have a look at the Manhattans. The top buildings are all uh, in the top half. Karnataka bulldozers batted beautifully, paced their innings nicely. The first 10 uh, were phenomenal. They petered away a bit towards the end. Uh, but then, they're still much better than uh, what Kerala strikers are doing so far. Yeah, we see a plan with the Kerala strikers, wickets in hand and the final turnovers to produce 100. That should be the plan, but even that now, the next three overs are very important, 8, 9, 10. Because if you don't uh, get to 100 in 10, which means if you don't get, say, 70 in 10, then you could be in trouble, handsomely driven and very well fielded. Come on, come on. So it's all been really singles. We saw uh, a stat there some time back. It's probably been around 25, 30 balls now that there's been no boundary. And uh, boundaries do matter. Especially in the early stage. Here's uh, a very important partner of the Kalyan Jewelers is uh, Celebrity Cricket League. Radio City. FM. Nah, Radio City. 91.1. Thanks for your help. Oh boy. Buys. Raji Pillay. Showing just a hint of desperation with that pull. Maybe it was short enough, but certainly didn't climb enough. And uh, I think Sudeep uh, perhaps took his eyes off, thinking the pull is on. And missed a pretty regulation keeping opportunity. I think it was beaten off pace, both the batsman and the keeper. The ball was con had gone past him, and that's the boom Chikawawa moment once again. Another boundary in the kitty of uh, Kerala strikers. I think Sadeep's eye was somewhere near mid-wicket after the attempted pull. That's the problem, uh, Akash, we mentioned it earlier, that uh, they are a little top-heavy, Kerala. Much better than last year, mind you. We've got some very good cricketers, but if these guys don't score now, could be tough. That's another Facebook.com CCL reminder. Off the pad, perhaps. Just a single. Leg by adds to the extras, Kitty. I think the set batsman, Pillai, will have to take the lead now. He's sweating profusely. Obviously, it's quite muggy in Chennai. It's warm. And, and in Chennai, we famously say that we have about three weathers. That's hot, hot, and hotter. There's an amendment to that. I'll come back with it. Oh, yes. Fine leg is up. Not a very clever delivery by Dhruv. Drifting down leg and Rajiv Pele. All he had to do was ensure that he puts a little bit of bat to ball. Kerala strikers camp should be a little happier now. Bomb chicka wow wow moment. 12 from the over. At the end of eight overs, Kerala strikers are 48 for one, doing a good job, the Karnataka bulldozers, to actually restrict them so far. I have with me Chiran JV Sarja. Well, you're not playing today. Tell me, how much are you missing out actually being on the field? Uh, I'm, missing, I'm missing a lot. Um, I mean, see, there is a lot, totally different kind of an energy when you're there on the field. And uh, due to uh, an injury, shoulder injury, that's the reason I'm not able to get on field. Okay, but you know, your team is one team which has been consistent right through. What do you think is the secret to your success so far? Nothing much. Uh, we're just following uh, captain, uh, whatever he says. And uh, he's always been saying that uh, just be calm and just focus on what, what you want to do. So that is what I guess it's a secret of us. You know, I also hear that uh, the bulldozers actually before the season, they take their cricket very seriously. For like almost two months before the tournament starts, you guys like shack up together and actually go every day and practice and are very religious about it. Is it all true? Yeah, very much. I mean, uh, uh, in Karnataka bulldozers, uh, I'm so called as lazy bugger. But uh, it is a kind of uh, a rule that every person in the team has to be there by 5.15 in the morning. And uh, yeah, I mean, it feels good. In the beginning, it's like really, uh, really tough to like maintain the timing. But uh, as the day passes, it's really fun to. Is be. there like a punishment if you don't? Um, not really. 
No, then what's the then what's the incentive? <laughs> no, I mean it is just our commitment, and uh, I mean meeting up. It is like we get a time to spend only once in a year. That to all 20 of us, so that it's 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 a nice feeling. Well, your teammates seem to be very excited about you doing this interview. This, what were you just shouting, guys? Come on! This is all about teamwork, as you can see. Thank you, Chair GV, for talking to us. Thank you. Thank you so much. And it's back to you guys. Thank, thank you, Arjuna. Waking up at uh, what? Maybe 4:30 a.m. or something to be at the ground at 5:15. These guys are uh, showing a lot of discipline. Perhaps a bit more than uh, actual cricketers, uh, Charu, because these days the games start in the afternoon and you don't need to have those early mornings anymore. Yeah, but it's for training. These guys are all busy and how do they take time out from the busy schedules to try and uh, go for the nets, the training that it requires. So, yeah, just uh, to confirm uh, their commitment to the Kalyan Jewelers as a celebrity cricket league, they're all working very hard. Struck handsomely. Slot swept for a four. It's a welcome boundary. Bum chicka wah wah moment. They need a few more of these. Uh, she isn't perturbed yet. No need to be. Long way to go for the Kerala strikers. The hand came off the bat while playing that shot. One bounce into the fence. It's a boom chicka wah wah moment once again. Good acts, girls are dancing, and so is the spaceman. Well, he chose his area carefully between mid wicket and long on. Sharp stuff in the field. Throw with a pick up and throw. 55 for one after nine. Well, spin has been introduced now after nine overs. The Karnataka bulldozers were 84 for one. That's the comparison. Kerala strikers are 55 for one. Lagging behind in the, in the scoring rate, but then uh, they have every opportunity to make up for the lost time because they haven't lost wickets. You know, Akash, this is the key over. New bowler, spinner, he may give you a couple of boundary opportunities. If Maddy here decides to slog, certainly Raji Pillay, they could make a big difference right here. Manjunath. Oh, two fall and an opportunity oh, goes a begging. Whenever I see a spinner flighting the ball these days, it just excites me so much. Because it's not every day that uh, we see again a flighted delivery. He's taking the pace off the ball, challenging the batsman to create pace of his own. And it's not easy. You have to use your feet, get down to the pitch of the ball and, uh, and play through the line. I'm disappointed at those two dot balls. Finally, the short one thumped away. And yet, it won't go for a boundary. The sweeper comes in, they decide to take on the throw. And it will be an easy two. Long boundary that side. A good 80 yards, if not more. Manju Nath is very clever. He flighted the first two deliveries. He knew that uh, the batsman will be looking for something big. The third ball. Shortened the length, bowled a little flatter. This, what a good shot. Beautiful shot, came down the track well, to a well-flighted delivery. Mohan is uh, putting that foot on the accelerator, a bomb chicka wow, wow moment. I'm just glad the umpire got out of the way. He'll take uh, evasive action and just about got away in time. We'll take a look at it again. Straight down, ah, shake of the head. And it was struck very powerfully. Good for the Kerala strikers. An important bomb chicka wow wow moment. Like I said, this could be a pivotal over. Got too close to it. Hitting it straight down the ground, pitching it fuller. And that's not all, that's not a bad ploy. And here are our uh, energy efficient partners, Godrej Eon, the One Watt project. And uh, you can also join in at uh, www.onewattproject.com and pledge to save some watts. Save energy, make a better planet. Last ball of the 10th over, after which, of course, we will have a long strategy break here. Time for Kerala strikers to get their act together and figure out 
what they need to do in the last 10 overs. 10 runs and over is the call. 10.62, matter of fact. Will Rajiv go for a big one? One ball left. Get close to 70. No, he doesn't. And not a single either. So a good end to the 10th over. 62 for one. 